morning, exactly 22 years to the day since the Winchester Medical Center first came to the community, the medical center expansion is now complete. A ribbon cutting is scheduled for this afternoon to mark the end of a construction project three years in the making. This is what the Winchester Medical Center campus looked like three years ago, and this is what it looks like today. This is an exciting, historic day for Winchester Medical Center, and most importantly for our community. Winchester Medical Center President Al Pylong says plans for the expansion have been in the works for at least the last six years. The $161 million expansion project has created more than 350,000 square feet of new space and 78,000 square feet of renovated space. Translation? It really allows us to have a state-of-the-art facility, a great place for our physicians and staff to work, and a healing environment for the patients that we're privileged to serve. Some of the changes include the emergency department expanding from 50 to 60 exam rooms, the clinical laboratory upgrading equipment and getting more room to work in, and women and children's services are also in for a big upgrade, particularly the neonatal intensive care unit that's moving from ward-style rooms to private patient rooms. Parents will have privacy in the rooms with their babies. The babies will be able to have quiet and sleep cycles, which research has shown is very important for the brain development of the babies. There are also a lot more features here that make the stay for mom and dad more comfortable. Many could be here for an extended amount of time. On the Winchester Medical Center's 22nd birthday, leaders here couldn't be more happy with the direction it's headed. This campus expansion project will take us to the next 20 or 30 years, and I think that's great news for our community. To see us outgrow and now go into this, it's just, it's unbelievable. Winchester Medical Center is holding a community open house from 10 to 2 tomorrow, where visitors will be able to get virtual and live tours of the North Tower.